Good evening, my friends. This is VJ Franz K. And uh, I just noticed that Tilt Brush has gotten a major update that uh, those of us using Oculus Rift are very interested in. Yes, you can now see the touch controllers. They look the way they're supposed to. And uh, they control. You can adjust your line width using the joystick. You'll also notice that it has an automatically moving spectator camera. Yeah, you can see me as I'm drawing here and uh, looking at the palette, changing the different things. So that is a nice update for, um, you know, people like myself who like to make art videos. Let's see, we'll move the spectator camera. We can change it to circular and then I guess it'll rotate around this entire area and I can see where you are looking at also because there's a spectator camera going over there let's see other things I should mention they added a bunch of useful features but uh, of course let's see I can switch the camera to the head camera where it normally is so you're seeing my viewpoint here once again change the mode to stationary and then i can move the camera to wherever it wherever is important to see things there's the fire <coughs> Uh, let's see. So that's good for um, paying attention to a certain area of the video. Um, and you can see the figure eight. The figure eight could be useful because you are, in order to see the 3D, the 3D look of everything, it's nice to have a little bit of motion there to just reveal the depth of it. There's supposed to be a way to make the controllers invisible also. I haven't noticed that on the uh, inside of the app here, but we'll figure it out later. But I can flip through the control palette items with the thumbstick, so that's very good for the uh, you know Oculus Rift, Oculus Touch. Um, users like myself and basically this update is great news for anybody but especially for those of us with these controllers so anyway we're going to keep illustrating and uh, tilt brush is perhaps the most well-known VR the most well-known VR art app right now. And there are uh, some others which you've seen on my channel. But um, this one has got a lot of attention and obviously it's, uh, it's pretty great. And there are all of these, uh, there are all of these different um, tools that you can use that See, I'll move my camera, start to draw something, and then move the camera. All sorts of interesting brushes that, you know, depending on what you're doing, some of them, some of them may seem to be too much or too, too strange or something, but... Um, 
On the other hand, it might be just right. You know, this one has a sort of high-tech art look. And you notice everything you draw with this gets set up into these, uh, you know, grid made of squares and triangles, basically. But then uh, with this, I can take one of the other sort of looser brushes like the chromatic wave. Oh yeah, and uh, since the the touch controllers are now fully supported, you can see you can easily change your line width from thick to thin. And yes, these things do respond to audio. So you can get you can play some music or something like that. See, I'll move the camera once again. Change it from that to stationary. And we'll point it back in this direction. So you select your spectator camera and then use your use your shift um, I mean your your grip use your grip to looking through this thing use your grip to move the things clear this one and I don't know if you can see this or not I guess I'll turn it back on head camera and maybe you can see it. So uh, if you're painting with a bunch of certain colors, you can just press this add button now and it'll save a it'll save a list of these colors here. You know, the sound effects do sort of add a fun sense that you're still, you know, painting with physical art tools here. A little tip, uh, sort of rainbow colored brushes like this chromatic wave. If I select green, it's still going to have some other color in there, but you know, green will be the dominant color then. But then I can go back and select my red. Or the orange. Then go right back and select the green without having to use the eyedropper tool as you previously had to do. So that's very convenient because, you know, just like uh, any artist in the last uh, millennium, you're going to be mixing from a few different colors of paint. So there you can specify your colors of paint or lines or whatever. So there's going to be a lot more fun. And uh, just in case you're wondering, how do we make the, the hands switch from left-handed to right-handed? Because you notice that I am a lefty here, as a lot of artists are. If you want to select from left to right, just bump the bottom of the controllers lightly. And then your palette hand and your primary drawing hand will be switched. So now I'm on right-handed mode, and just touch them once again, the bases, and I'm back to left-handed mode. So anyway, um, that's one thing about Tilt Brush, is uh, the tools are just a lot of fun, and you're going to... Before you know it, you'll probably come up with something that you like. And, uh, well, you might as well save, save everything that you kind of like, because as long as you have hard drive space, there's room for more art. Still, it's easy to move it around using the two grips here. Let's see, I'll turn it back on the rotating camera just because. See if I can 
select that, move the rotating camera so it's, it's facing the work here, and then maybe it'll go around it. So anyway, this has been VJ Franz K with a quick introduction of this newest um, nice update for the tilt brush. Just switch it back to head camera. Please subscribe, and uh, I've been uploading a lot of art videos lately, and you can see how the process of virtual reality art happens. And it's very intuitive. I like doing this, and I think um, I think that you will too. If you are already using VR or if you are thinking about getting into it, there's going to be a lot of discussion about that on this channel. So please do subscribe here on YouTube. And uh, I've just reached a thousand videos uploaded. So there's a lot of different things for you to watch. Got a bit of a scratchy throat right now. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe. This is VJ Franz K. We are living the high-tech lifestyle to the fullest.